27. Ah. An open field right next to the U.S.-Mexico border. This is the location of the Holy Father's final mass, the culmination of his visit to Juarez. More than 200,000 people are expected to attend. Volunteers spent days assembling all of the barricades needed to contain the crowds. Tickets for the mass were distributed among the parishes of Juarez. 10,000 were also distributed across the border in the Diocese of El Paso, Texas. Already pilgrims are arriving in Juarez. The security is ready to handle the massive influx of people. The Pope's route through Juarez is about 25 miles long, starting at the airport and ending here at the site of the border mass. The Diocese of Ciudad Juarez is organizing tens of thousands of volunteers to line that route shoulder to shoulder, forming a human chain. These volunteers will keep the 100,000 expected onlookers off the street and tend to their needs as they await a glimpse of the Holy Father. Father Roberto Luna is in charge of organizing the human chain. 45,000 people, 45,000. We are looking to get 60,000 or 80,000. We, we make the, uh, the finish line in 80,000. So we are looking and praying for God that he, he, he could give us all these people. When the Holy Father arrives at the Mass site, as many as 70 bishops will be there to celebrate Mass with him, 40 from Mexico and 30 from the United States.